My name's Peter Thompson and I'm the garden manager of the Botanic Gardens. As a gardener since 1997, having to think about that one. <laughs> Durham Botanic Gardens was set up originally in, it was set up in, in the late, in the 60s. It's one of them places where you can walk a hundred yards and not know your way back. It's, it's round little little corners. You'll you'll get a, the woodland garden. Then you go down some steps and you'll go to the Japanese garden. You'll go across into the meadow, across a stream, um, and it's it's literally all over the place. But in a nice way, you can, you can get lost in little areas. Where where we've got our um, friendship garden, which is like a, we've got a circle. We've got. Um, a dozen granite seats laid out in a circle and then you've got um, cherry trees all the way around that. It's amongst an area that's full of cherry trees and daffodils. It's, it's set in a way, it's sort of like a bowl, so it does block out all the other noise. Um, that was originally set up because we, we, had a, we knew there was a visit coming about by the Japanese ambassador of the UK. On days like today, you've got all the blossom falling on them, so it's, it's as if it's snowing down there. Oh, there's definitely over 3,000 plants here. got things like in our greenhouses where we've we've got a an arid house um, we've got a tropical house we've got a bit of a conservatory which has got a fish pond with koi carp and things in wolfia which is the world's smallest flowering plant most of our orchid collection over the years is, is from customs and excise and it's it's basically ones that have, people have tried to smuggle abroad and stuff so we, we've been lucky to get them. It's nice on, on a day when you go out and the sun's shining and the birds are singing and you see this, especially this time of year, you can see, it, you, you, get, you do get a little bit down in the winter when you see everything closing down, but then you see it in the spring and it's, 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 it's good for your well-being. Um, you go around and you see all the, the, the flowers, like, the, like I showed you the fronds of the shuttlecock fern opening up. So it's that time of year, it's like, it sort of revives you, yeah, everything's coming back to life. 